Not as high as they went, definitely not. Nah, we're bringing him to the top. No, please don't. Yeah. All I had in my mind that time when I read these grateful words. That's magical. <laughs> Okay, I have no idea what we're going to do today, but I know Alex is here and I'm meeting him and we're going to get into some trouble. In the show, we're just a bunch of kids who are forced to create this new world, this new society, and part of that is giving up some of the comforts uh, that certain people are used to. I have no idea what I've signed up for. Um, road trip to New England was the pitch, but you know, something tells me that there's gonna be challenges ahead. I think it's uh, fun to just dive into new experiences, and that's like part of my personality. What is this? Go to the stairs where the Freedom Trail meets Beacon Street. Lovely. I thought it said bacon, which I was pretty excited about, but okay, come on, let's go. You look through the lens. Say hi. Stop it. Tasha! Oh, Jack! I think these are for us. Yuck! We got clues. Come grab your back. Oh. Yeah, there was all kinds of stuff in them. Oh my god! What are we doing? I'm catching some seafood that oh I'm terrified of. <laughs> it was just like a mystery grab bag and a whole bunch of hints and clues. Uh -oh. Does this mean we're gonna be like abandoned in the middle of nowhere? Yeah. Oh, that's Flint. Stop! You gotta ruin my clue! <laughs> let's go! Let's go! Oh. My God. My God. When the bus is pulled up, I felt like we were going back to New Ham. Why are you getting on? Have it's you learned nothing? <laughs> it's gonna be different this time, Tom. It's not gonna be different this time. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Hey guys. What's Whoa. going on? Hey, how's it going? Yeah, we got some obstacle courses for you. Some <laughs> part of surviving involves some teamwork, and we're gonna help you uh, polish those skills. This right here is called the Moby Deck. Mm -hmm. It's a 360 seesaw. Your challenge is first to get all four of you on here and to stay balanced for 10 seconds. Sorry. Your second challenge uh -huh. is to sit down in the spaces where you are while staying balanced. Do it. Ah! This is yeah. the problem. Everybody just gets on. Okay. Okay. I'll get, okay. On, I'll get on this side right here. Okay. Oh, if we all hold hands, that that'll mean that we're. So just means you're gonna pull me down if, when you fall. Apart. We've got some good energy between us. I think we all got on and it just balanced. Yeah. 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 Leaning. Leaning. There we go. Leaning. There we go. Leaning. There we go. Leaning. And then right, we need to so sit down. Ten seconds. All right. Sit down, bad boys. One. Oh, cool. That, that was excellent. Thank you. <laughs> Put it down there for us. You are gonna stop just about there. Watch. Oh, 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 my God. Oh, I want to go. What are you yeah, doing? Let go, guys. Oh, oh, this looks like a blast. I want to do that. I feel like a beast. I feel like I'm ready for action. I feel like this helmet's a bit too big. <laughs> Shake your head yes. Shake your head no. Yeah, that's too loose. We're going to yeah. fix that for Okay, you. great. Right. What you'll do when you're up there is you will pull that and release yourself. <laughs> you guys better not drop me. Hey! Oh, God. So oh. <laughs> I'm worried about Catherine. Synergy, bro. We pulled each other's weight, <laughs> literally. Oh. You guys, this is really, really high. Okay, here I go. Three, two, one. Oh, oh my God. It was really intense. It's like a roller coaster. <laughs> And then Alex doing it was my favorite moment of this entire day so far. Oh man, I was so proud of Fitz. <laughs> um, not as high as they went, definitely not. Nah, we're bringing him to the top. No, please don't. That's fucking cruel. No, he was legit scared and, and I think like... No, I wasn't. Yeah, you were. Dude. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> yeah, that's good. <laughs> All right, you sure you don't want to go any higher? Yeah, no, no, I'm fucking good. The swing was very life-changing for, for me. I never liked heights, and I've always been afraid of them. <laughs> hey, no, that wasn't that bad, actually. <laughs> Should I get higher? No, no, I take it back. I instantly regretted that. Babe, look down! Look at me, babe! Look at me! Ah! Oh my God! I don't want to we all cried on the floor. This is how Spider Man feels! He conquered his fear, and that's the that's the lesson that I think we all were able to take away from it. Hey guys, what's up? Oh, Jeff, yeah. He was incredibly knowledgeable about the forest and the woods Down in where he just happened to be. You can go three days without water. Right. You can go a month without food. The first thing you need is shelter. So you've stayed out all night in one of these before? Many, many times. Wow. Some mornings I woke up and there'd be steam coming out of the shelter. I was so oh warm. Oh my God. Like the New England Bear Grylls. Wow. Yeah. We had a moment um, of building that, that uh, debris hut, as he called it. All you have to do, guys, bend over and you'll get nice and warm. And then just gently throw them on. All right, Jock, show us how it's done. Wait, seriously? Get yeah. in there, big boy. Get naked first. Yeah. You definitely just got to commit. All right, let's do it. Jock, yeah. get in there. Yeah. Wriggle in. Ooh. I want to see this. Oh. You feel safe? Yeah. Comfy? Yeah, it's actually pretty comfy. You're trapping dead air as you speak. You're basically like decreasing the amount of dead air or, or increasing the amount of dead air. It was a little bit unclear, but it was, it was super cool and we learned a lot. Bye, Jock. Bye, guys. We're gonna talk about fire and I'm gonna show you how to make an efficient fire. Jeff reminds me of my dad. <laughs> Um, he's kind of no-nonsense, which is great. Where do you start? A tree. Small and dry. Tinder is small. What? Tinder. Oh. Fucking millennial. <laughs> Tinder. It, you know, it rains Tinder, last like the night. dating app? He probably should be on the show. We'd survive that way. That's right. The key to flame. That will not go. In your little room. Fitz, back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. Are you trying to get burned? I'm just oh warming it up. Oh my god, the up. smoke coming out. <gasps> now I'm going to crank on this sucker. Okay. He's going to crank on this sucker. Let me know if you need some. Whoa! Whoa. Fire in the hole! Have you got the tinder there? Oh my god! That's magical. Thank you for showing us. That was really cool. Oh, it's Thank my you. pleasure. Peregrine Falcon, oh. and you're at New Hampshire School of Falconry. Wow. I need to see your hand size, because I want a picture size. with gloves. I have had birds my whole life. I've raised pigeons and magpies, and I've had a rainbow lorikeet. How many birds do you have here? We have 11. So I'm not afraid of birds, but I'm also very aware of their strength. Because even like a cockatoo in Australia can take your finger off. We're going to hold a hawk. I hear that they can rip your face off, so that's pretty chill. <laughs> you were asking about my pockets. Oh, oh. oh, mama! I'm sorry. Wait, is that a chicken? Jesus Christ! If I know Nancy, I know she was going for the shock factor when she first did the quail. She pulled it out, ripped its head off. She just ripped a head off a bird. Okay, so we're gonna fly and fly fast. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh, wow! There's a wood adventure come and see. We've been missing out the chill and it's so good to be free. Here he comes, right between you, yes! <laughs> It's probably one of the coolest things that ever happened. I felt very presidential when Scoot flew onto my glove and ate that chicken head. Scoot's 
Scooter kind of like reminded me of a dog. He was off the wire and he kept flying back. That says something. Queen, don't they, Dave? Yeah. They are at the moment. They're pushing me all over the place here. Nice. We're the queens. Wait, yeah, we got. Woo! I want to make some waves. Now, what do we do with these? No! <laughs> Stella board on the right. <laughs> hey! We learned how to do this. Come to me, bird. <laughs> So what happens is the lobsters and the crabs, they smell the bait, so they come to find it. So they walk up here, they fall through that hoop, they get in that compartment and they're just stuck. They can't find their way oh, out. Wow. Do they not have eyes? They have eyes. They're just, um, I guess it's more that like, they, hey, they, they lobster, just don't know that they're Do they stuck, not have you know? They don't realize they're trapped. Will we catch a lobster right, today? So oh. Oh, look at it go. They're pretty mellow. Oh my god. <laughs> How precious. I think my poodles will love him. What do we name him? Hey guys, we caught a lobster. We oh, got one. What? Lands on the back, it's a keeper. So just give it a little It'll grab hook. on a little bit. Oh, like it's it has, grabbing on. It has a little bit of pressure, but it, it won't hurt you. I touched her and she held my hand. And I just knew, you know? No, oh, no, I can never eat one again. Look, it. he's holding my hand. I will hold you in my belly. I love lobster. I love lobster rolls. I love lobster bisque. I love raw lobster. Hi, baby Geraldine. Can you poke her in the eye? I'm going to eat her later. <laughs> give, it, give it back. I know. Give it back. I couldn't help how I felt. By the end of it, you know, she had held onto my hand for like 15 minutes. And I just looked into her little black eyeballs. You know? It was energy coming out. No! Yeah, Dave's getting a bit nervous. He wants his lobster back. It's just kind of cute, you know? It's like so helpless. We're setting it free. We're setting it free! Don't lie to me, are we really? Yes. Yes, no, you cut the bands off. Cut the whoa, bands whoa, off. Whoa, 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 that's my dinner. No, it's not. Get out of here. You're not allowed to set him free. I slipped him $40 to pay for the lobster that Natasha wanted to keep. Hey, make sure it. you hold that claw. I'm scared, of, fingers. Fingers. I'm scared of my child. I'm scared my of my child. Okay, okay, here we go. Go! Go! <laughs> yeah! yeah. I mean, it was looking good. I was kind of hungry, honestly, but they wanted to free Geraldine, and I just have to embrace it and accept it. I'm not crying, you're crying. Get out of my face. this? Why would this be deserty? Glaciers? I'm just laughing that we're doing this here because it looks exactly like the abandoned part of New Hamp. Should we rip these off? Okay. What does this say? So these are actually tops of trees. Oh, They're buried crazy. by the sand. Why they continue to grow is a mystery. How about that? What? These are the trees that are covered by 20 feet of sand and they're not baby trees. They're like buried trees. Yeah, I know Australia has spiders and snakes but like a this bear will kill you. For real. Where did the sand come from? Does it say that? Glacier silt. What does that mean? What's a glacier silt? The leftovers of melted glaciers. Oh my god, it's so smooth. Right? This is how it feels on the show. This is just episode 11. Yeah, it's Wait, episode 11. Back to basics. All right, let's light him up. This is going to take a while. Where's Jeff when you need him? <laughs> All right.
See you, Netflix!